today we're going to talk about a protest device called a sleeping dragon. These come in a variety of different styles. Uh, they're all homemade. And the idea is to block some access that a protest group doesn't want you to get into. And they're fairly simple. Uh, this device is simply a, uh, a four inch piece of PVC pipe. It's about two foot long. You can pick it up at any major hardware store out here. Uh, inside of uh, this particular device, and let me show you one that we've cut in half. Uh, it actually has roofing tar rubbed on the, right on the pipe, and then it has hardware cloth uh, inside there. That very thick quarter inch wire, wire fence in there, and it's wrapped in duct tape. The idea is to make it difficult for anybody to cut into this. Well, the reason they cut into this is there's a carriage bolt inside here and sometimes I'll actually double nut these. I'll put a nut on the inside and the outside. So if I'm a protester, I'll handcuff myself uh, to my wrist. I'll put maybe a chain and tie that off to my wrist. Then I'll reach through the device and I'll take a carabiner and I'll clip this in. And then I'll wrap myself around a fence post or something so that uh, I, I can't, you can't take it off unless I release it myself. And the way this would look, Jamie's going to give me a hand here. I clip myself in and Jamie clips himself in and now we're blocking a fence to a road to some sort of access that we're protesting and the only way we can take this off is if we actually unclip. Well in the fire service we may be asked to come out and help to take this apart when it's safe to do so and there's a couple different methods. Uh, uh, find the bolt along here somewhere and if you could push down on the tape in this case, you can see where the bolt is. Sometimes you have to peel a little bit of tape away. I don't recommend taking everything off because the tar gets everywhere and it makes the job just a little more difficult. And once you find this, using a tool, maybe a, a Dremel tool or something like a little a disc grinder, a small handheld disc grinder, just slowly cut through these. Uh, and protect your patient, eye protection, all your standard PPE, and get your way down until you have a sight hole. And eventually you'll be able to get down in and you'll cut through the PVC, take a screwdriver and pop that out and look in and see where you can find the carabiner. Take some sort of a small hook, pull that carabiner up or pull the chain up, either disconnect the carabiner or just take a small set of wire cutters or even bolt cutters to reach in there and clip that and then slide this off. Uh, a small saw, not a large saw. The idea of this is to help somebody to get them out of here and you do this when it's safe to do so, not when there's active protest, there's any threat of any harm to you. Uh, short version on the Sleeping Dragons, there's a lot of different ways to do this. Uh, have a great uh, HDR day. <laughs>